Hi friends, in this video let us solve a network theory related question asked in GATE 2015 to paper. The question is, for a given circuit, the Thevenin's equivalent is to be determined. The Thevenin's voltage V Thevenin in volt seen from terminal AB. So across this we have to find V Thevenin. That's what they have asked. Okay, let us see how to find. So V Thevenin is nothing but open circuit voltage. So if I want to find voltage across AB, simply I need to find voltage across 2 ohm. So that is enough. So I apply KCL. Let us assume this is node, this node has potential V1, this node is V2. I apply KCL. So what is the thing? At this branch, I write node equation for every branch. So you see in between two non-reference nodes, we have one, what do you call? Uh, one voltage source. So it is a dependent voltage source. So we have to apply super node, super mesh analysis, right? Super node analysis. Okay, let us see how to do. Okay, so first I apply KCL at this node. So for this branch, it is V1 minus 2 divided by 1. Next to for this branch, it is V1 by 1. So you just to ignore this branch now, apply KCL at this node V2. So V2 by 2. If you want to know in detail about supernode analysis, please refer my video on supernode analysis equal to 0. This is equation number 1. So this is the first step. Next to what we have to apply, we have to apply KVL at this super mesh, this branch. So KVL. So you see, only take this branch. What is this branch? This branch. So V1, we have V1 here, V2 here. There is one dependent source minus plus 20 I. So it is like this. In this here we have plus minus. Here we have plus. Here we apply KVL. So start from here. It encounters. This uh, voltage source in first, so minus, so it is minus 20 i. Then it is encount current encount here, current encounters plus terminal, so plus V2. Here it encounters minus, so minus V1 equal to 0. So this is equation number 2. Okay, let us see. What is i? i is current flowing through this or no branch. So I can write i is V1 by 1. So I is V1 by 1 that is equal to V1. This is equation number 2. Substitute 2 in 3. So it will become minus 20 V1 plus V2 minus V1 is equal to 0. So this indicates 21 V1 is equal to V2. This is equation number 4. What is equation number 1? Equation number 1. Okay. So this one if you simplify what we get is. Let me simplify this. So 2 is LCM. So if you simplify 2V1 minus 4 plus 2V1 plus V2 is equal to 0. So it will give 4V1 plus V2 is equal to 4. This is equation number 5. So 4V1 plus V2. 4V1 plus V2 is equal to 5. So from this equation I understand v, uh, V1 is equal to V2 by 21. So V1. So 4 into V2 by 21 plus V2 is equal to This is 4, right? I think it must be 4. 4 V1, it is 4. 4 V1 plus V2 is equal to 4. Uh, 5. So 4. So this is 4. So I take LCM. So it is 21 V2 plus 4 V2. 25 V2 is equal to 84. V2 is equal to 3.36 volt. Right, so we got V2 is equal to 3.36 volt. Now we understand why I find V2, I don't mind about V1. Because V2 is 3.36 volt, so V2 is voltage across this 
2 ohm so that is what my voltage across ab so v2 is nothing but vab so that is what v terminal is so answer is 3.361 no need to find v1 so that's why i found only v2 so this voltage is same as this voltage so this 3.36 volt thank you